about that. I am doing a post about the oils that I use because I am now three years into being on tamoxifen. One of the side effects of tamoxifen is achy joints. So I have achy joints in my hands and my feet. Specifically, when you get up in the morning, you can have like very achy feet. Uh, I see a nutritionist who has recommended uh, some products and I was gonna show them to you. I've been doing them for almost three years now and they really do help because I noticed that when, you know, I, I, I run out and I can't get, get them in, you know, and I'm not taking them for a few days, my joints start to ache really bad. Uh, my feet ache more. Um, so what I take on a daily basis um, it, to help with the side effects of tamoxifen, this is really just for the achy joint part of tamoxifen. Now, what tamoxifen does also, before I just name the oils, um, tamoxifen blocks your estrogen and who knew, but estrogen lubricates, helps lubricate the joints. So that's why there's the achiness. Okay, so... I take two in the morning and one in the evening, uh, tuna omega chewables. Now I don't chew them. <laughs> um, I swallow them and I could not uh, take fish oil ever. I tried years ago, you know, just like uh, as in college and stuff and it would always like burp up oil. And uh, so what is different about this is it is, what I've been told is it's been, I think, free frozen or something, the way it is manufactured. So it is freeze dried. So it's fast frozen or something like that. And then that way um, it's, uh, it, and then for some reason I don't at all have any, I don't burp up fish flavored stuff. Um, so I take that, I take two in the morning, one in the evening. I also take linum B6, which is also uh, an oil that helps with joints. And it's, the products are from Standard Process. And I take that three times a day. Um, I usually just take it two times a day because I the container I use is morning and evening. And honestly, I... I I can't be carting around a middle of the day pack as well of, of pills. Uh, but if I'm home or if I remember, I'll try to slip that in. But I'm doing really pretty well twice a day with that. Um, I just added this one in, evening primrose oil, because I was having some achiness in my right foot even more, um, especially when I run. And it's called evening primrose oil. And it's by many herb. It's the same standard process. Um, and I take that, uh, it's recommended. She said you could take it once a day, but um, in the beginning, she gave me like samples to try and I added it in, it really worked. And I would do uh, once a day, she said, if you're still feeling achiness, take it twice a day. I added the second pill and it's great. Um, so those are the oils that I'm taking currently for my joint pain. Um, it really helps. Now, I also take, because tamoxifen can cause your bones to, um, um, what's it called? Oh my gosh, I can't think of it. <laughs> um, thin out, that's not the right word. Um, I take Osterplex and that helps with it. But, so I take two in the morning and two in the evening. And, um, Oh my gosh, when people get old and they get this, they can get like, it's brittle bones, but that's, that's like a common term for it. I can't think of the name of it. Uh, it'll come to me, but that helps to counteract the effects of tamoxifen. Um, and I also take, uh, I get a lot of, I was getting a ton of muscle spasms and um, really bad um, muscle aches and things. And so I take this, this is not through the nutritionist, this is through my acupuncturist. Um, Cal six, so it's calcium, vitamin six, B6 and magnesium. So it, but it's this brand, uh, it's called Douglas Laboratories. Um, I've tried the Whole Foods version of this, not the same. Um, and this was on back order, I couldn't get it for a while. 
and I felt the difference. My muscles started spasming again, um, uh, tightening up. I was getting Charlie horses, like waking up in the middle of the night getting Charlie horses. And so once I started taking this down, it went away. Um, and that's a real problem if you're a very active person. So how do I keep track of all this crap? Um, that's just one, two, three, four, five. Those are just five things I take. I have a whole container of other things I take. Um, so those are the oils. I use this kind of uh, bulky thing. Um, I just got the color, the colorful one. I bought this on Amazon. This is BPA free. And um, they have, uh, I take, you can see Sunday, Monday, you know, this is the AM and then this is the PM. Do, 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 do. And um, it just pops open and all my pills for the, the evening would be in here, you can see. Um, and all my pills for that day in the morning are in there. And like I said, I don't have a middle of the day one. I've actually considered getting a middle of the day one and then just putting the extra, some of the pills I take during the day. Um, but those are just the oils I take. Um, and then I take obviously the tamoxifen and the Effexor, um, and I'm now on a top of trite something and some other things, that's a whole other thing. Um, but, um, and then I take a multivitamin, biotin, those all help. But what really helps with the joints and the joint ache and everything it, are these oils. And it's this brand, these brands as well, this brand. And they're really a high quality and I take many, many oils. So, um, I just thought I would do a, a kind of, um, to celebrate the anniversary of three years down, I have two more to go, uh, tamoxifen consumption. <laughs> I'm almost done. I'm almost there. Um, I have also added fasting. Uh, so, and I feel so much better. I, I can't even believe how much better I feel. I'm not as tired at all. And I, that was a big thing on tamoxifen, being tired. And I have a toddler that I'm running after and all the time, and that's exhausting. And I, um, this, the fasting has really helped. So, that's what I've been, that, that's pretty much what I've been doing to counteract the effects of, of tamoxifen. Uh, that's what I've learned in the three years I've been on it. July 20th of 2016 is when I started. I started at 20 milligrams um, and I gained uh, 25 pounds of water weight and in a month and a half when I started and it was really horrible. And so they took me off of the tamoxifen for a month and a half. And then I was on it for about a year um, and then they decided over the summer, that summer of 2017, so I was on it for a year with that extra, like carrying all this water weight around. They switched it to 10 milligrams. I, w I went off, I went on a tamoxifen break for a month because the, the pain and the, everything was just so bad. And the water retention, you could almost see it in my bone, my, my skin, um, was so bad. So he put me on 10 and I started that again. I went off for a month in that August and then I started back again in September and of 2017 so I I've been on it yeah for three years ten, uh, for two years 10 milligrams um and it's been I, I immediately lost at least it was like 10 pounds um and I still retain a ton of water but it's much better um the fasting has actually helped and I what I'm doing with the fasting is I'm eating between 12 and 7 every day um and then uh they added a pill, a water pill too. So I take that at certain times of the month um, and that releases a lot of the water. It's an ongoing battle, but I'm three years down now. Um, and uh, I may switch to five milligrams. Um, that is an option for me, but I'm a little nervous about it. Um, but my oncologist is okay with it because I'm considered low risk for, re for recurrence or a new primary. Um, so, uh, and, and the the statistics are showing that it's an equal um, what's the word? It's an equal kind of um, the study, they're showing like equal results as to being on the ten or the yeah for my 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 it's not for everyone but for me um, because I'm low risk considered low risk so. It's, there's a lot to think about, but as of right now, I'm staying on the 10. Um, uh, the fasting has really helped me uh, because it was really getting to the point I was so tired um, all the time. And so we'll see where that goes. I'm gonna 
see my oncologist again in December, um, I, I can email him and, and tell him, hey, this is how I feel. I might just try to hang on a little longer. Um, but the three year mark is kind of significant because that's really where the studies show the significance of decrease of recurrence and new primaries forming um, from being on it for three years. So that's like, I'm like, yay! Um, <laughs> Um, and what I've discovered is, I'm, I don't know if it's helpful to anyone or not, but uh, those oils are really, they really do help. Um, and uh, yeah, that's it. Two more years, two more years, two more years. Have good days.